Barbie, I'm super hot. When I'm in the dealership, should I get the coupe or not? Should I get the roof or drop? Should I get the choo choo truck? Crazy, I get Google Buck. Cuckoo for the Cuckoo Buck. I'm Cuckoo for Google Buck. The shoot with Honey Magazine was amazing, flawless, magnificent. <laughs> Well, my personal style is evolving. Um, I mean, I, I love pink. You know, I've always loved pink, and I love it even more now. And um, my image is is still taking, I think, form. You know, like it's it's not set in stone yet. Right now, I just do whatever the hell I want to do. Um, I'm gonna start playing around a lot more because. Inside, I feel like a big, like a, a cartoon. Mm -hmm. And sometimes in rap, you don't feel like you can kind of like, you know, dress outside of the box, so to speak. Mm -hmm. But I'm gonna start. Like meaning what? Like, give me an example. Just like being more, um, dressing more with costumes and stuff like that, mm -hmm. as opposed to just something that anybody can pick up off the street. Okay. So I think that's important. And that's kind of like when I rap, I, I think I, I, I almost sound like a character as mm -hmm. opposed to just like, person rapping. So I'm gonna, you know, bridge that gap and and that's about it. That's my block. New York City to the top, tippy top, bust a shot. I think Queens girls are girlier than all the other boroughs. Oh. We're girly girls. I am the Barbie. Where the fuck is Ken Ken Ken? I mean I feel like I'm so far I'm so past that now. Mm -hmm. Um I think people just use people use comparisons as a way to start a conversation, mm -hmm. you know. And um, I mean, people that really know Nicki Minaj do not compare me to anybody. It's almost a lazy comparison, yeah, right? Right. It's it's like okay, what, what's well, you know the first person that comes to mind, and that's who they compare me to. Um, you know, as far as my lyrics, I've I think I've evolved a, a lot with the lyrics and trying not to um, be so. I guess promiscuous with the with the raps. As far as the album, I've I've been working on my album for a very long time. Um, it's slated to be released in the first quarter of next year. Mm -hmm. And um, in the meantime, Young Money compilation album will be out this year. And um, we're about to shoot a video for the first single, so you guys can look out for that. It's gonna be crazy. Awesome. I've been doing a lot of features, you know, a lot of a lot of features for a lot of artists for their albums. And, um, and that's about it. You know, Beam Me Up Scotty has been very well received. And so if you don't have Beam Me Up Scotty, you can still get it on NickiMinajFans.com. Yeah. So the, the album is going to be, it's going to be geared to everybody, you know? Everybody in the world, not uh -huh. just people in Southside Jamaica, Queens. Even right, right. Shout out to Southside Jamaica, Queens. But it's just going to be more of a universal record, no pun intended. It's going to be pop stuff, pop sounding stuff, rock sounding stuff, uh -huh. pop sounding stuff. Just a, you know, just an experimentation. Yes, Benjamin Franklin. I mean, but yeah, to all, my, to all my Barbies out there, you know, you date George Washington and Benjamin Franklin and Abraham Lincoln, you'll be better off in life. You know what I mean? Get, okay. get that money. For real. When your mama sleep, then you can call me and get out the business. Um, I think a good wifey is naughty and nice. Too nice is not good. You'll get cheated on. Um, you get bored. Yeah. And, you know, because guys need some, some, um... I guess stimulation, like mentally, so you gotta be a bitch to them. Mm -hmm. The more of a bitch you are to them, the more they wanna hold on to you. Well, get me all them pretty furs, cause my Old, wrinkled, and white on 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 a green piece of paper. <laughs> I'm about to go and do a crazy song right now with Gucci and Bobby Valentino. Um, um, incidentally, I'm gonna annihilate Gucci on the record. Gucci keeps on texting me saying, when are you doing it? I said, just sit your ass down and prepare for your ass whooping. Um, he was like, you know, he, 
he was really gonna like go in. I said, Gucci, please. I'm Nicki Minaj. You know what I mean? No, it's that. <laughs> um, but it's gonna be really cute. Me, Gucci, and Bobby Valentino. I, everybody's gonna love it. All my girly girls are gonna really like it. Um, yeah, and, and I'm supposed to go to to um, Canada to do a couple joints with, with Drake. But you know, Drake, is, Drake, he's cocky. I gotta put him on time out for a second and let him, let him, you know, Salute the Barbie, you know what I'm saying? Let him know what time it is. Okay. But, you know, that's my baby. So, we're, we're, we're definitely in the works um, talking about some stuff that we're going to be doing. And, I mean, right now, um, I've gotten a lot of requests for features. I'm doing it as, you know, as I get time. But, ultimately, I just want to take time out to uh -huh. do Nikki. Because uh -huh. I haven't done that. Like, and so, what's couple, that? What's that? Just, just recording my own music. Okay, and, yeah. Because you know, I, I do a lot of, a lot of features, and uh -huh. so that takes time. Because I'm doing, I do a lot of shows. Then I come home, I find myself only doing features. Uh -huh. So, um, for the next two months, my goal is to take time and do Nicki Minaj music. Uh -huh. Because I think I owe it to people that have been following me to give them that. You know, they've been so um, loyal. Mm -hmm. And I want to, I want them to know that I'm I'm a real deal artist, and I, I write records, not not even just hip hop songs. I mm -hmm. write music like for pop artists and all types of stuff. Me, I am Minaj. I am Nicki Minaj. I like it because I think they like it. Mm -hmm. You know, I didn't want to do a Twitter, but I kind of. <laughs> well, after the first five fake. Nicki Minaj Twitter, so I was like, you know what, I have to get on here. Soulja Boy kept on texting me, like, okay, I got a new Nicki Minaj hitting me. Is this really you? And I'm like, no, that's not me. But now I have it, it's at Nicki Minaj. Mm -hmm. um, and they enjoy it because you don't really get to, I guess, um, really interact with the person that you, the artist that you like. So Twitter is a good tool. And, mm -hmm. and all that, like, I was born on the internet, you know, mm -hmm, so mm -hmm. I'm not gonna, I can't hate on it. Right. I mean, it is what it is. It's, it, it's made underground artists be able to um, develop themselves mm -hmm. and you know all, all of that stuff I did prior to today has been without a major label backing me so that's what the internet has done mm -hmm. and the internet is, a, is the best tool you just have to be smart with it because mm -hmm. it, it can also kill you it can also like really you know annihilate your self esteem mm -hmm. if you get too caught up in it do you read so, the blogs and I don't know. read them I don't okay. read them Any, anything like about me, really, I don't read them. Like uh -huh. even if there's an article somewhere about me, and people will call me and tell me I won't read them. Uh -huh. It's too. <clears throat> it puts you. It puts you in the mind frame of um, a victim uh -huh. too much. Uh -huh. And when you when you're a, a powerful person, you can't play victim. Uh -huh. You know, victim has to go out the door. So sometimes when you read negative things, it's like you feel sorry for yourself, and there's no room in life to feel sorry for uh -huh. yourself. It's just like yo, let's go. And then, you know, yesterday I, I tweeted something that Reverend Run said. It said, if you don't have any critics, you probably don't have any success either. Mm -hmm. And I think that's the that's so so freaking true. I mm -hmm. mean, it wasn't even, like, really poetic or anything. It was just the damn truth. Mm -hmm. And so now I've come to realize that people criticize Nicki Minaj because Nicki Minaj is Poppington. <laughs> so that's, you know, that's how I look at that. I'm at that slumber party, sipping on that frizzy. You know, I always sign their boobs and hug and kiss them. I love my girls so much. They, um, they're the best. I couldn't ask for better people to follow me. Um, oh yeah. And it's Barbie, bitch. <laughs> and we love you back. Thanks, Nikki. Nikki Minaj. And if you want a Minaj, keep a couple pretty